And hi YouTube, it's another episode of It's Easy It's Simple It's Coffee, it's friend Oscar here with today's special guest, Jason Diaz. Now today's episode is going to be all about Jason. You guys are get to know how, you know, my friend Jason here, we're going to get a little bit to know about him. So we're going to start with a couple of questions, um, you know, your full name is Jason, um, you know, Jason Diaz. Um, who are your parents? My parents are Romero Diaz and Gloria Diaz. Okay, and uh, where, where were you born? Well, I was born in Cook County. I lived in Chicago for like five years. Moved to Waukegan, lived there for another two years. Then I came to Zion, where I basically grew my life. Oh, so you lived in Waukegan then? Yeah. How old were you when you left to Zion? Uh, I was about eight years, eight years old. You see that? I did not know. So we're gonna get to know him. Um, so where did you go to for high school then? Did you go to um, Zion? I went to Zion Benton for okay. all four years, and now I'm going to CLC. Okay. Uh, is it your first semester in CLC? Second semester? A second semester. Okay. And um, so when you, when you grow up, what, what do you want to do when you grow up? Well, initially I wanted to be a soccer player, but injuries kept that from happening. So I decided to stick in school, and now I'm going to be a radiologist. Yep, so I guess that's every you know, Hispanic boy dream to play soccer. So I remember that, that, that. I wanted to do that. I was about to go to El Salvador for, and go play for the Selecta, but it didn't happen. Um, so let's go with a bit more questions here. So, where, where, where are you planning to go after college? Oh, I'm planning to go after, after CLC. I want to go to Harper for another two years to get my certificate okay. for radiology. After that, planning to basically look for a job, stay there for another five years, then try to look for a better paying job. Okay. So, are you looking at going two years at CLC and the next two years at uh, Harper College? Yes. Okay. And you're going into the medical field. Um, what are some hobbies you like to do when you're not, when you're free, pretty much? Um, working on my car, playing soccer, um, going out, having fun, friends, family, just basically enjoying the day. Okay, especially now that it's getting warmer outside, so um, you know it's definitely good to enjoy the weather. And uh, you know, as you grow up, where where would you want to live? Um, I would like to live in Lake Forest or okay. Libertyville, one of those towns, just because it's almost in the middle of basically everything that you want to do, Shop, shopping centers, parks, um, nice neighborhoods, basically the typical stuff that you want to be around. Yep, that's exactly where I want to live too. I want to live in Lake Forest or uh, um, I might start off living in Grace Lake, but you know, it's about Jason today. So um, let's see, the, if you had a pet, do you have any pets? Oh, uh, I have, I have uh, fishes. I had a shark, but it, it died. So, I have fishes now, but what I want to have is an English Bulldog, because I just like how they look, and they're a family dog, and they're loyal, so. Yeah, it's a really good dog. Uh, all right, so as a, you know, successful mindset, you know, I'm pretty sure you have, you know, an ideal house of where you want to live and how it looks like. Can you describe that for us? Well, in er everybody's mindset, you expect, oh, I want a big house, big yard, big garage. Well, me, I'm more on the simple side, where I just want a decent house, decent yard, decent garage. Basically, somewhere where you have a good time. Have you? You have. My main focus is good vibes. Cause good vibes bring most happiness. Happiness you make you're comfortable around your house. Yep. So you know all of that. Not knowing about now knowing about um, Jason. Um, you know another thing that I wanted to know about is like you know what makes you happy, or not what really makes you happy, but you know what brings happiness in your life. Um, family. Friends and my, my girlfriend reason why is that they understand me and they love me for who I am and for not for the things that I've done in my past. They just basically love me for the person that I am. Okay, so not knowing now knowing that, um, what what would be your like uh, your role model? Like who do you look up to? Um, I don't really have a specific role model, but like I look up to my dad because like as when he was young, around my age, he never had the things that I've had. So he's always try to give us what he never had, and like me, that's something that I'm gonna try to do when I'm older. Give my kids what all the things that I didn't have, give them to them. All right, great, nice. So now you guys know Jason Diaz a little bit more. Um, so you know, thank you guys for watching. This is gonna be it. Um, you know, I'm gonna leave a link of you know his. If you guys wanna add him on Facebook and whatnot, I'll leave the link in the description below. <laughs> um, so thanks for you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, see you guys doing my research and I was like, you know what, you know, I, I, now I have two, you know, I have the Sony Action Cam and I have the GoPro Hero. And uh, what, I, what I found out was, I like the Sony a lot better. It was a lot cheaper and just because not a lot of people know about it, but it was a lot 